We all found that very difficult to watch last night. Um, what about you? How did you feel? Yeah, party with me, it's never nice seeing a, a parent cry, and especially my mum, because she's like my best friend, so it was heartbreaking, yeah. Well, we, we never see her cry. In fact, crying, as she said on the programme, is something that she really hates to do, so that must have been even more difficult to see her breaking down like she did. Do you know what? I've, I've seen her cry probably uh, no more than five times. One of them was in Big Brother last time around. Uh, one, because she hurt back at home. Mm -hmm. And then a couple of times, obviously, protecting the family and stuff like that. So it's just not nice. But Shane, it's, it's like, because um, she said it from the very, very beginning that she hates crying. Does she see it as a bit of a personal weakness if you cry? It's something mums shouldn't do? I think she personally hates crying in front of her children. Yeah, she's never done it, even through all the breakups, you know, arguments with Ray at the moment. You know, I've just never seen her cry, ever. Do you think your mum and Ray will come through this? Do you think they'll stay together? I, you know, at the minute, it, it, it doesn't look great. It doesn't look great, does it? But I hope so. I really do. You know, Ray's been there since I was 12. He's a, he's a yeah. good friend. He's a great stepdad. So can't really speak on behalf of Ray, of course, but... How I does really he feel? To... How does he feel, her going in the Big Brother house? Uh, we were all, not just Ray, we were all a bit like, really, again? You're going to put us through it, let alone yourself? Uh, but we're all happy, we're all rooting for her. He's glued to the telly every night, as we all are. Is he worried that she might talk about their marriage and their relationship while she's in Big Brother? He worries about that every day, being on the show with you ladies. <laughs> so, of course, yes. <laughs> yeah. so, Do you, yeah. Shane, having watched the show now yourself, because we all know Colleen really well here, and I watched it and I thought, actually, maybe also she has her share of blame in why the marriage is not doing very well at the moment, because she's sort of owning up to lots of issues herself. Do you see it from Ray's point of view as well? I see it from both. And, like, with every relationship, you both have to... You both have to put effort in, you both have to talk. Ray's a shy guy. He doesn't talk about anything, really. Uh, and, 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 you know, he, he, that's... He, he really does have to start opening up for my mum, for him and my mum to carry on. It's the same with my mum, really. I think she bottles a lot as well. Yeah. She really does. She That'd sort of said that on the show, didn't she? Mm. She said that yeah. when he, he sort of almost wants her to have an argument to sort of clear the air and she leaves the room. But, I mean, how... I know you don't sort of particularly live at home now, but you're there a lot. How hard has it been for you the last year sort of living with it? Well, I, well actually, I have recently moved back in and it's, it's not been great. As soon as they argue, I go straight down to my girlfriend's house because uh, it's, it's, it's never a nice atmosphere to be around. Mm. Um, and I do feel sorry for my mum a lot because they... But at the same time, they don't argue. Mm. Do you think she did last night's programme, it was a therapy session, to try and get him to do therapy? <sighs> well, yeah, maybe. Maybe. I think Ray could benefit from it for sure. But like I say, I'm not Ray's spokesperson, I'm sure. I feel like he needs one from time to time. Like I say, he's a friend. He's obviously my friend and he's my stepdad and I love him to pieces. But, yeah, I'd, I'd say they both need therapy, for sure. Have as you, a couple, as a relationship. Have you tried to talk to him, Shane? Have you had a kind of sit-down, man-to-man, heart-to-heart, saying, look, come and talk... You can't talk to Mum, talk to me? Yeah, we have. We've had many a heart-to-heart -heart, uh, over the years. And you know what? It's just not him. He doesn't open up and he's quite open about that if you get my if you get mm. it but it's just who he is and uh, whether we come to accept it or whether my mum comes to accept it we'll have to see but you know uh, at the minute it doesn't look great but has I hope he, that sorry great. shane has he watched the program ray uh well i wasn't with him last night but i'm sure he probably has yeah i've not even spoke to him today actually but yeah i'm sure he has well hopefully then being apart you know absence makes the heart grow fonder um, and now this has all been brought to light, that they can work things out now, because this mm. really is the final straw by the sounds of it. Yeah, and I think it's probably going to do my mum and Ray the world a good a few weeks apart. Hopefully the full four weeks, hopefully she goes on to win it. But I think, yeah, I th like you say, Katie, type, uh, absence does make your heart grow fonder, so let's hope, let's wait and see. Well, we'll wait and see. We're missing you already. Now, I told, a little bird tells me, that you've got a big surprise planned for her when she does come out. Hopefully, that's at the end. Yeah, well, I've just decided, obviously, I've been known as Shane Ritchie Jr. for a while, that I thought, I'm going to go support my mum. I'm going to change my name and I'm going to put it to Shane Nolan. 
That, she knows by the way, nothing. will make her cry. But that yes. will make her cry. <laughs> and she knows nothing about it. No, knows nothing. She'll come out and she'll be, you know, calling me Richie Jr. No, it's Nolan now, love. If you, oh, if you oh, maybe you'll have to brilliant. come on the show and do it, Shane. We'll surprise her when she comes back. Listen, yeah, thank you so much. I'm sure your arms are aching from holding whatever device you're on there. So thank yeah, you I so need, much. I need to go back into hospital and make sure my girlfriend's OK. Yes, yeah, so we'll send her our love as well. Thanks, <laughs> Shane. Thank See you, you love. Much. Bye bye. Bye. We get some pretty fabulous guests here on Loose Women. There's plenty more where that came from. Just click here to watch more interviews with a whole range of famous faces. And click here to subscribe. It's free, so you'd be silly not to, really.